was good to see you being crushed. Your boy Cam been back in the mix, you know what I'm saying? Yes, sir, you feel me? Live and full effect, man, you know what I'm saying? Hey, man, we about to end off the new year. We about to head to 2023. I'm spreading positive energy, uh, motivation, affirmations to success, the new goals, whatever you pursuing. We all gonna do it, we all gonna accomplish, we all gonna get better, man. You know what I'm saying? And I'm not just saying that just to say that because it's a new year. This is this is not for those people who just be wishing all this way. I'm talking about for the people who have that grinding and sacrificing and putting in that freaking work, man. This, this is who I'm talking to, really. This is who I'm talking to. This, the people, my, the real CBN crew, you know what I'm saying? We putting in that work, putting in the time and the grind, you feel me? So, you know what I'm saying? Why are you future entrepreneurs, future uh, work, just for anybody, honestly, just honestly, no title, just anybody who out there putting in that work, man. We we gonna get together. We gonna we gonna make ways. We gonna find a way. We gonna pursue our dreams. We gonna make it happen, man. But uh, like I said, um, heading off to the new year soon. Um, life has gave us a lot of trials, tribulations, a lot of shit going on. But through it all, we still alive. We still surviving. We still got purposes to fulfill. We still got people people to you know what I'm saying help. We still got ourselves to sustain. We got finance. We got freedom. We we gotta go to pursue and get. You know what I'm saying. As I'm sure for the reason you clicked this video, you're here to listen to your boy um, spit a little bit of game and then a little bit of motivation and some stuff on the side, you know, things like that. Just talk about what's been going on and give y'all some uh, quotes. I got some uh, quotes written down that and some little other key points that um, I need to write down because I'm one of those people who got to write stuff down. Or either I'm writing in my in my journal or my phone and my note my notes in my phone. I got I'm that person. I got to you know, put it down, make it plain, and make it simple. So, yeah, man, um, let's get into this video. Hope you enjoy it. Um, Happy New Year's. If you're watching this in 2023, if you're watching this when, when you're actually supposed to be like a real supporter would, I appreciate you. You're the reason why I'm still doing this on the cool. You know what I'm saying? But don't forget to like, comment, subscribe. Two quick. <laughs> Two quick. Two clicks, a quick message, fast as five seconds. You know the deal if you real see me in that shit on top, man. We lit it, and let's get to this video, you know what I'm saying? Stay tuned. All right, man, so the first point I got on the notebook, man, is, or the first quote, rather, I should say, is, learn to make your money work for you. But the way I say it, y'all let the, you know, no, no, I said it wrong. Y'all paper chasing, but I let the money chase. You know what I'm saying? Let me break that down. So when I say by y'all paper chase, my little money chase, when I say y'all paper chase, I'm saying it as all you sell is your time. Time and time and time and time and time is all you know how to sell in your body. Like, there is nothing wrong with nine to five or just any other job that cries a lot of your time. But you got to realize at some point, you got to think to yourself, I can't be doing this for the rest of my life. I need something that's going to work for me in the future or something that's so easy to where I can make money just like that, you know what I'm saying? Where you don't have to hassle and spend all your time and things like that. You know what I'm saying? Now, there's certain instances where, you know, let's say you start a business, you gotta invest a lot of time to that. And then as you progress, you would, you know, hire, you know, staff and they would take care of it for you. And, you know, and th you know, you'll learn as time goes, you know what I'm saying? Produce, make your time productive. Make your time productive if you're gonna spend a lot of time. Don't just be spending your time out here working for somebody else for this show, the rest of your life and you got nothing else going on the side. That's when you up here in these you know what I'm saying, working for somebody else and things of that nature, that's when you need to be strategizing and plotting how you're gonna, you know what I'm saying, uplift yourself, you know what I'm saying, for your own business or your own time or your for your freedom, you know what I'm saying? So you can do the do the things you wanna do, go to places you wanna travel and you know what I'm saying? You ain't gotta worry about when the next meal coming, you ain't gotta worry about your family is struggling, you can get your, you know what I'm saying, get your, put your family on, you know what I'm saying, and stuff like that, just and just for you, just so you'll have freedom and you don't have to worry about nothing. And the other part of it, you know, I let the paper chase, that's just me saying, bringing, I'm putting, I'm gaining this knowledge, putting value to myself, to um, try to learn the skills and trades that, that will help me in my future, so in the future I won't have to work so hard or hardly at all um, for this money. Now, me personally, I want to always work for the rest of my life. Does that I don't want to slave for my money, but I always want to have. I want to always have a purpose to do something. I don't want to be like people who 
who in their 40, 50, 60 who just sitting on rich people money with it because they old and I'm sitting around the house rocking in the chair all day for the rest of my life. I want to, you know what I'm saying? It helps as well too. That's why I'm stay healthy. It's been working out. You know what I'm saying? Big body, you know what I'm saying? You want to be my gym partner? Come on. You know what I'm saying? I'm talk to the ladies, really. You know what I'm saying? But word indeed. You know what I'm saying? You know what I'm saying? I can get that. I can, you know what I'm saying? Boy, if you don't get that. On a serious note, learn to stop paper chasing and let the money chase you. You know what I'm saying? So all that saying is bring value to yourself, learn the skill set, and get busy, get to work. So the next point I got is treat your future like your homie so one day you'll appreciate yourself. My motherfucking niggas! Because one day you're gonna be that man that you thought of in the future, you know what I'm saying? Another way you can take it is some people say take care of the old man now, meaning you know, that person you thinking of to be in the next three to five, maybe 10 years, you're gonna be in one day, you know what I'm saying? Lord willing, you know what I'm saying? And he not gonna be, he, you gotta treat him like he's your, he's your, your right. ride or die, your dog. So you need to, you need to come out here and have a plan and strategize how you gonna get this money, how you gonna, you know what I'm saying, get your hustle on. And you gotta, um, you know what I'm saying? You gotta make sure that you make him proud. You know what I'm saying? When you out there, out there, you know, chilling with your home dogs or whatever, doing what y'all do, you know what I'm saying? You wanna make sure that he's straight, right? So why not make sure that your stuff is straight? Treat your future like your homie. That way he'll, you'll appreciate yourself because one day you're gonna be that. You're gonna be him. You know what I'm saying? That's gonna be you in the next five to 10 years, right? So you gotta learn how to maximize your time to your advantage and make sure that get everything straight and make sure that you make them proud in the future. Make yourself proud in the future. You know what I'm saying? Have something to live for, man. So what I got. The next point I got is very crucial. It's very crucial, so listen up. The recipe doesn't work or matter if you don't have the ingredients. And the ingredients don't matter if there's not a cook. Everything works in the system. Basically, what I'm saying is, like I said, breaking it down, you can have, let's say for instance, um, let's say a business, we're just gonna say, we're just gonna say, let's say for example, a clothing business. That's, that's very popular that something's going on with a lot of people. We're just talking about 13, 15 years old being hella money. Say for a clothing business, right? Let's say you the you the business owner, you're the cook. The ingredients is the shirts, and the recipe is the full-on business that you run it under, right? So let's say you got the you actually got a full out store like across the street that you own, right? You got this clothing store, right? That store isn't gonna work unless they has a cook or say the business owner there, you know what I'm saying? To run everything, run the staff or running yourself, you still running yourself, right? You still gotta put in work. But that store ain't that store can't be even be the store itself without the ingredients, which would which, which would be the clothes, right? So you yourself have to realize that everything works in the system. One needs the other and vice versa for the whole thing, right? You can have the best plan in the world, but if you're not willing to work, what is the plan for, right? And let's say you can have the biggest ambition and you can have the biggest self so you can be the best hustler in your city. But if you ain't got a plan to ask you go, how you gonna execute and transition to the next step in your life, or to the goal that you're trying to pursue, then you like what Jake, what Jake, what Jay, uh, Jay Cole say, what, what's your main Cole say? The good, the good, good news, news is, nigga, nigga, you came, came a long way. way. The bad, bad news, news is, is, nigga, you went the wrong way. You know what I'm saying? It kind of ties to that. So you gotta learn where you you can't just have a dream and not have a plan. You gotta strategize. You gotta know where you're going. So yeah, man. So I, I came up the dome. Y'all want a new song? I got some. I got some coming up. Y'all had some sauce. You know what I'm saying? If you heard my uh, song, my new song, hey, Preach, you know what I'm saying? Going hard, straight, straight to the bone. Hate the way, yeah, I put them on. Rain uh, money, yeah, my bank flooded. Hardships. And came with my last money. point is, always be a student to the game. Your struggle is the teacher in life we call experience, right? So, everybody got their own path, their own goals, their own ambition. They can go on doing this, doing that, yada, yada, yada. I don't care who you are. I don't care if you, I don't care if you live down in the trenches or boy, you live in the suburbs. At some point in your life, everybody is gonna go through life and have his say so with life. Life don't, 
You know what I'm saying? Life has its way with everybody. I don't care who you are. I care if you if you come from a celebrity family or you come from a poor family or you come from this family or that thing or this or that or that. Life is going to hit you regardless. I don't care what nobody say to you. Now, are some people's paths, you can say, judging by their circumstance, harder than others? Yes, but everybody going to have to go through their own hardship, their own experiences. You know what I'm saying? A lot of people may have um, a lot of uh, situations going on as far as finances, or say over here it could be mentality, or over here it could just be, I don't know, family, or over here it could just be them, within themselves on what they're pursuing. Everybody goes through struggles, especially when you're trying to reach to the top, you definitely gonna have struggles to flow off. But one thing you gotta understand is, everybody goes through struggles, bro, and the best teacher in life is experience, bro. Like I said, you need to, um, you need to learn all everything you can and do what you need to do. But at the end of the day, once you actually get your your feet out the you say get your feet out the mud and actually experience what you know what I'm saying, experience what you've been working on towards, you're gonna find out that especially when you when you pursuing like trading or entrepreneurship, a skill set, even just working just so deep, just working a regular job, you gotta work, man. You have to work. But your success is gonna, um, I guess, to add a little extra one. Your success is gonna is gonna pivot off of how much work you put in. See, most people think once they get off that regular job that they done working. See, the oh, where I sneak. The rich people, the rich people. Excuse me, I got sneak. The rich people mindset is once I get off this job, I still gotta work on my own crap. I gotta work on my future. I gotta work on my success, right? So you gotta learn, you gotta learn how to work on yourself apart from that, say that government job or you know what I'm saying, whoever you work for, whatever, right? And the sad truth is everybody ain't gonna be successful like they wanna be because everybody don't have that ambition, that hustle, that drive. You know what I'm saying? Everybody these days just won't people nowadays don't even want support from you they just want straight handouts they don't people when people ask you for this type of money somebody say some random person who don't even who never talked to you in your family and all of a sudden you get they see that you got money now they're like hey bro let me get that let me hold some cut like most people see when it comes to me when i when i know i know i'm gonna make it one day so when i when i make it bro if i when i if and when I give out, you know what I'm saying, money to, to my family, like throughout my whole family and stuff, like when they ask for it, you know, I'm gonna be the I'm gonna be the giver, because I'm a giving type of dude. Like I don't I'm not gonna be nobody who's just holding money just for myself. I want everybody around I want everybody around me to win. I want everybody eating off my table, bro. And you know what I'm saying? Not even just my table. I want I want you to I wanna teach you off of my table and then teach you how to build your own table so we can all eat on each other's tables together type shit. You know what I'm saying? So we can all feed off our own success, right? And People nowadays, like I said, they just want handouts. They don't even, they rather you just give them a thousand dollars or some money rather than you actually teaching them how to make that thousand for themselves and then some, like infinite. Like, it's crazy, bro, but it is how it is. You know what I'm saying? It's how it is, bro. But um, I want to uh, thank y'all for supporting me. That was, that was my little, a little uh, talk for, you know, you know, the motivational and stuff. Now I just want to talk to y'all for a little bit because I ain't seen y'all in a minute, bro. You know what I'm saying? I ain't seen y'all in a minute. I just want to talk about uh, things that's going on with me right now. Oh, before I start, um, you know what I'm saying? For those who don't know, I took the soul, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, I'm so rip, you know what I'm saying? A big agent, you know, big agent, you know, big agent. We see that screenshot? Go ahead, I'm going to give you three seconds. All right. All right, cool, cool. I just, just want to let y'all know. Um, yeah, man, you need a house, you know, you're ready to buy, sell, home, or move, and, um, you're in the, you're in the, uh, in Texas, and you in Texas, hit me up, man, I, I, I can help you with that, you know what I'm saying, it, you know what I'm saying, we really branding out here, we really, we, we really branding out here, <laughs> no, I'm just playing, but on a serious note, though, you know, for those who don't know, you, you know, I'm a realtor, so if you need help with that, you live in Texas, you're ready to move, sell, um, properties, let me know, we got you, I know what I'm talking about, I know what I'm doing. Um, trust me. Um, you know, with me personally, I've been, um, I've been planting a lot of seeds, man, and 
no real estate being one of them. I, I planted a lot of seeds for myself. I got a lot of side 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 things going on as far as skill sets and just learning different things like that. Um, one thing I learned is um, you need to um, value the journey and the road to success is not a race, it's a marathon. People need to understand that there's only so much in this world that you can do. And part of your part of your your success needs to be from the journey. That comes that helps you with being humble. It comes with a uh, gratefulness, appreciating everything that you get from beyond there once you do make it. You know, things like that. It ties to a lot of things. It's it's kinda like, um, shout out to Aristotle. I've been um learning a lot of stuff from him. It's kinda like like he said, like the stock market. You don't wanna you don't wanna um, gain success too rapidly because once you get a fall a, a down a, a downfall of it, um you ain't gonna know how to act. Your emotions gonna get the way you're gonna act you gonna act crazy. You're gonna be like, damn, shit gonna happen. But if you gradually, you know what I'm saying, have your little your little ups and your downs back to exponentially throughout the five to ten your process or even quicker if you feel like that. You, you know what I'm saying? You'll be good. You'll actually appreciate your life and everything else. So learn um, everything is a, every, the path is a journey, not a race. You know, things like that. Um, I just want to point out um, this, and um, I sincerely mean this. I right, take my hoodie off for this one. The world doesn't owe you shit. It's a lot of, it kind of ties in with the people just want handouts and support thing too. It's like, people gotta understand bro. Like you need to have a mindset to think that of being a giver, but also don't expect receiving. It's like, you will be so much more happy with your, I promise you. Like, once you let go of that, the world owes me something or this person owes me this for that, or this family member owed me uh, this for back then, when, back then when I was, you know what I'm saying? Or cause, cause you know what I'm saying? The man above, he gonna, he gonna check your, he gonna always check your work. And he gonna know who been doing good deeds and you know what I'm saying? You know what I'm saying? And he gonna, he, he gonna, at the end of the day, whether you believe, believe him or not, he know who doing what. And when, when you add that with work, faith that works today, when you add that with work and you know, believe, you know what I'm saying? To follow him, can't nobody stop you, I promise, I promise. Um, like I said earlier, everybody's path is different. Everybody gonna go through their own struggles, struggles and tribulations. But at the end of the day, if you really want it, you gonna get it, man. And I really, um, I'm really out there praying for y'all and hoping for whoever is really willing to learn what they need to learn, hustle the way they need to hustle and do what they need to do. We all, we gonna, gonna make it. Sorry y'all, my camera done up today. I was getting to my last point. Um, I was just saying, when it's the time to do what you need to do, what you're pursuing, the time is now. Um, you know, really should have started yesterday on the cool, but I'm gonna let you slide. I'm gonna say it now. And even if you're watching this, man, so it's like six in the morning or 12, 12 at night, it don't matter. It, don't, it really don't matter. Like, even if you're about to go to sleep right now, even if you're about to go to sleep, just, just put in an extra like five minutes just to just learn something about what you want to do. Just any, just anything. Just start with something. Everybody starts. Everybody starts somewhere. You gotta start somewhere, man. So my, I'm saying my plan is the time is now. But before y'all go, I wanna give y'all a quick prayer. But again, don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, share this video so more people can get motivated, inspired because we all need it at some point. But you, some, you know, what I'm saying what I live by. You gotta turn that motivation to discipline. So. Everybody bow your heads, give y'all some prayer. Yeah. Yes, bow your head right now. <laughs> Thank you, Lord. Thank you. Lord, Father, Yahweh, we come to you right now. We just we just want to give you thanks for abundance and blessings on blessings, Lord. We just want to give you thanks for everything that you've done and everything you're going to continue to do for us as we continue to believe in you live by your live by your word live by your teachings your commandments as we do that we just ask from you who is that you just help us learn our paths and learn our ways and for any forgive us for any wrongdoings and that we learn through through your way that we can turn for the better lord i just ask for that the person that's watching behind the screen can 
learned something, had some, got, gained some value from this video, and hopefully now they're motivated and inspired to do what they need to do. Maybe use a little kickstart form or just, you know, something that they need to see or hear. Hope that they gain value in the um, in this video. Hope they gain something from it. I pray that as we continue to work on it and work towards our goals and inspire, inspire to be what we want to be and live out our dreams, that you always keep, keep, learn to always keep you in the forefront of our minds so that no matter what we do in this world, it won't matter when we're dead or we're so, when our souls are, are upon your hands. And I just want to, again, give you thanks for everything that you've done. And I speak blessings for everybody out there that's going through something. I pray, Lord, that you stay with them. And, um, and just want to have your hand open throughout the journey. And one more time, I just ask again that you just bless everybody who's watching. Pray that we all can become successful. In your name we pray. Amen, you will. Amen. So, one more time, please do not forget to like, comment, subscribe. Please join the CBN gang. We litty, man. 1K grind on the way. Until next time, we all gonna be successful. Yeti! <laughs> See y'all in the next one.